China has launched a spacecraft to allow them to bring three astronauts stuck in the country's space station back to Earth. The unmanned Shenzhou 22 wasn't supposed to be launched until next April, but the crew on the Tiangong space station currently have no way of returning home if there was an emergency because an earlier launch vehicle was declared unfit to fly after its window was cracked by suspected space debris. Well, Chinese state TV showed the three astronauts on board closely watching the launch. Space officials still have to work out how to handle the damaged vessel. Some experts have suggested it could be undocked from Tiangong and deorbited over the Pacific. Well, our China correspondent Stephen McDonald says that there's a sense of relief all round after the successful launch. Less concerned now than they were before today's successful launch. I mean, perhaps what I should do is just go through the sequence of events so people understand what's happened. There were three astronauts on the Tiangong station and they've got their vessel ready to go back. Along comes the next crew. They dock at the station at, you know, shake hands, see you later, time for, time for you to take over, we're out of here. But unfortunately, their vessel that they were supposed to use to go home in had been hit by a bit of debris, apparently, possibly space junk, something along those lines, potentially uh, smashing a window. So they had no way to use that vehicle to go home. They took the new crew's vessel back, leaving the new crew up there with a, no way of returning to Earth. Now, in a way, it's not so worrying because they're not due to come back till next April. But what if there's an emergency? What if something went wrong with the Tiangong space station? What if one of them had an injury or something like that and they've got to get out of there? They would be feeling much better today because what's happened is a rocket has taken off from Western China and a new module has now successfully docked on the station, giving them the ability to return home next year. As for the broken vessel, well, there are two possibilities, apparently. Even to get it back to Earth, it has to be repaired. There's some talk of just taking it off the station and cutting it loose in space because it's occupying one of the docking stations. The problem with that, of course, is that that's yet another piece of space junk. And remember that it could be something like that, which has hit this capsule in the first place, which has damaged it and rendered it unusable. Uh, but either way, it, it's good news for those three astronauts or taikonauts, as they're sometimes referred to here. I'm sure they'd be much happier knowing they've got a way out of there as of tonight. Our thanks to Stephen McDonald.